Hi and welcome to my channel. Thanks for stopping by. Today I'm going to do a haul on some hair and beauty products that I recently purchased. Some of these products were purchased from Superdrug and Boots, which are well-known health and beauty retailers in the UK. And the rest are from my local beauty supply store. Okay, so let's start. So now we're gonna start with Superdrug. What I got here is the Keracare Humecto Cream Conditioner. I used this conditioner two days ago and this is really, really, really good. Like, I wish I bought two of these because Superdrug were doing deals on curly hair products and, you know, products for Afro-Caribbean hair. This Keracare brand, their products are somewhat expensive. Gosh, like this made my hair soft instantly. As soon as I rinsed it out, the moisture and the softness stayed on my hair like I wish I bought two. I think this is originally seven pounds. I'm not sure but I would recommend you to get this. This is another product from Keracare which is their oil moisturizer with jojoba oil. This is a product that I also used as well um, two days ago and gosh this oil moisturizer gave my hair like super shine like it made my hair so shiny and um, it did not give that like greasy shine because like you know sometimes you can your hair can look shiny but in a greasy way no this gave like a natural shine and when I apply this on my hair like it felt like I did not apply anything so this was a little confusing for me because I'm not used to that I'm used to like when I use oil moisturizer feeling the oiliness and feeling the greasiness this does have a little oily feel to the hair but if you're someone who likes to use heat tools on your hair like flat irons or curling irons this will not leave your hair looking or feeling greasy so yeah this is another great product that I'm glad that I bought this is the ORS olive oil replenishing conditioner this conditioner I've used it before like I love this conditioner this again is great for if you have relaxed or natural hair and I would say this is a light protein conditioner this is a conditioner that I feel that you can use daily and yeah this is a great conditioner. This is the Shea Moisture Jamaican Black Castor Oil Strengthening and Restore Styling Lotion. I just wanted to try this um, styling lotion because it has a lot of great ingredients. It has shea butter, peppermint and keratin. It seems to be an all natural product and again I got this for an affordable price at Superdrug. This is the Al Pacin Caffeine Shampoo. It stimulates hair roots during washing. This is um, something that I wanted to try as it's a caffeine shampoo. Kind of been suffering hair shedding, I'm not sure the reason why. Since caffeine helps with strengthening the roots, I thought why not give this a go. And yeah, this shampoo is actually catered towards men, but women can use it too. Hopefully this will help with strengthening my roots. I did notice less shedding after using this shampoo but again I've only used this once I can't really be certain about that this is the cream of nature moisture rich hair color with shea butter conditioner um I thought of maybe like coloring my hair I got the color in c43 lightest blonde trust me this is not gonna come out this color like with my hair it's not gonna come out this color I have used hair dyes before not from this brand um, I've used the hair dye from dark and lovely and I used a similar color to this for the ombre look that I had in the past I'm not gonna use this everywhere on my hair it's just gonna be on the length of my hair and plus this is ammonia free so hopefully it's a little safer than the ammonia dyes but either way hair dye is very harsh on the hair whether it's ammonia free or not especially if you're someone who has um, chemically treated it hair like me who has relaxed hair but anyway we'll see how it goes I also got some beauty products and these ones are the L'Oreal ultra matte liquid lipstick less chocolate <laughs> sorry I'm not a French speaker so I got the shade Choco Crush I really like this shade this is like a deep burgundy shade and I really love um, lip shades that are burgundy I just feel that they suit me best and I also got the shade 70 Yum this 70% yum, I actually have it on my lips right now. I think it's alright, but I'm just not used to using brown 
lip shades on my lips. I am more into the Choco Crush because it's a shade that I am comfortable with. I like using deep reds and burgundy shades on my lips. I also got two of these L'Oreal Telescopic Mascaras. The reason I got two of these is that I just wasn't sure which one was better. Now moving on to boots. I got the RS Olive Oil Oil Moisturizing Hair Lotion. I did a review on this so you could check out my previous video. It is a good moisturizer. I really do like it. It's really, really moisturizing. But one thing I don't quite like about this is that like it's hard to get the product out. You have to like keep shaking it to get the product out. And you know, it can be a waste sometimes like not being able to get everything out of this. But again, this is a really good moisturizer. Like I really, really like this. And this is the RS Olive Oil Creamy Aloe Shampoo. This shampoo can also be used as a neutralizing or a clarifying shampoo. This is great for removing relaxers, making sure your hair is neutralized. And um, this is also great for clarifying your hair as well. This is the OGX Anti-Breakage Keratin Oil Shampoo. This is something that I also use as well. And it really smells nice. Like I love the smell of this shampoo when I used it and also this is a sulfate free shampoo so um, again if you're someone who doesn't like using shampoos that contain sulfate you can try this out. Now this is from my beauty supply store. I got this RS Hair Restore Hair Mayonnaise with Nettle Leaf and Horsetail Extracts. So again I have done a review on this hair mayonnaise with the oil moisturizing hair lotion so this is another great product like I really really like this hair mayonnaise this really strengthened my hair and it also made my hair really really soft I really like this hair mayonnaise and I will continue to use it it's lovely then I got this my favorite RIS olive oil professional cream relaxer okay I just realized I got the wrong strength. I got the I got the um, one in extra strength. I always get the one in normal strength. Like I don't know how I made I made this mistake. Like it must have been when I got the one from behind. How annoying is that? Like I'm just gonna have to suck it up and get another one in the normal strength. Like what a waste. I like texture in my hair so I feel if I use this extra strength it'll just make my hair bone straight and I do not want that and this is just a brush for your edges it look like a toothbrush but it ain't and it's made with natural borrow bristle then I got this mesh wrap I always like to use a mesh wrap when I'm wrapping my hair because I just like it to stay in place and the last product that I got from my beauty supply store is this Blue Magic Hair and Scalp Conditioner I'm sure all of you know this old school product most of you grew up using Blue Magic as weird as it may seem I actually grew up using Dax the green version as a child I remember using Dax and Ultra Sheen this feels so good and it's soft like let me just show you what it looks like it also has olive oil in it too so and I do have an ASMR video coming soon on how I use this product it's so soothing on the scalp it feels so 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 good yeah so that's it for my haul I hope you enjoyed watching this because I enjoyed showing you all of the products that I got like um, they're all great products for hair care and also beauty Please like, comment and subscribe and hope to see you soon, okay? Bye!